Sefton's public engagement and consultation panel is celebrating its 10th anniversary. The panel offers support and guidance to make sure we listen and engage with the public about the issues which affect them. My name is Councillor Paulette Lappin, but I'm the Cabinet Member for Corporate Resources, Compliance and Enforcement. And I'm also the Chair of the Public Engagement and Consultation Panel. What it sets out to do is if our partners have an issue they wish to consult on, we have an issue that we wish to consult on, people can bring those issues to the panel, they can ask questions and the panel have got lots of expertise and they're actually able to say we can help you with this, why don't you do it this way, I know some people who can actually help you and so therefore it's about working collaboratively with all our partners to get the very best for the residents of Sefton. Through its activities, the panel have taken the views of thousands of residents from across the borough. One of my roles was to um, engage with the public and to set up consultations about healthcare plans. But I was lucky enough to have partnerships with members of the local council and Sefton CVS. We decided that it would be a really good idea to have a panel that could support and scrutinise plans for engagement and consultation activities in Sefton. So we set up the panel in December 2008. Since its launch, the panel has advised on 168 consultation and engagement activities. If we don't understand and if we don't talk and listen to our communities about what's important to them and how things will deliver in the best way for them, then we can't possibly put in place policies and services that deliver to their needs. We've made positive changes within our communities as a result of the panel working together. After a consultation on swimming pool use, the council improved its leisure offer. This included refurbishing facilities and improving awareness of activities. This resulted in us being awarded just over half a million pounds by Sport England. The old changing rooms were a bit dated. Reminded me of a prison. <laughs> Not that I've been in one, but now I think it's lovely. They've done it really well. I think it's really nice, especially the um, the shower cubicles. Since the swim pilot came along, like loads of marketing's come in. We've had like loads of flyers, advertising stuff, all the different sessions we do. Our consultation on the public space protection order and dog codes was also hailed as a great success. During the consultation process uh, for the dog control public space protection order in 2017, a group of dog walkers came to our attention called Sefton Dogs. Sefton Dogs not only contributed to the public space protection order consultation, but also agreed to be part of a group alongside other council officers from Green Sefton and the Dog Warden Service. This was to uh, support the introduction of the Public Space Protection Order and to ensure uh, or devise a dog code. The group's main task was to canvas residents' views on and other community groups on this topic and as a result of this uh, the Sefton Good Dog Code was produced. And our consultation on King's Gardens in Southport resulted in the area being beautifully restored. King's Gardens was a very rundown area within Southport and we wanted to bring the gardens back to life again. We went out um, in the gardens, also into the town centre, we did questionnaires and people were saying that they would like improved seating, improved lighting, that the buildings were brought back into use and, and one of the most important things was accessibility. So King's Gardens is vastly improved now from what it was. It's an area where people come instead of a void. On the whole, when we're working and doing our voluntary work, we get a lot of positive feedback and they'll say, oh, you know, this is really good and uh, keep up the good work and all that. I feel it's important that the council consult the public and the volunteers because we feel, both of both groups, that um, we're involved and the council are um, appreciating what's needed in the gardens. It's the public that use the gardens. They know what they want from the gardens. This panel, has actually been held up as um, an example of extremely good practice in relation how to engage with the public and also with our partners. I think it's extremely important to celebrate uh, good work. I think too often in this life we actually face very negative comments all the time. This is an example of how we can all work together collaboratively. We get the best results in the end and we actually really help local residents 
to access services so that we can improve those services because in the end it's about the council doing the very best it can for the people of Sefton. What makes me the proudest is that 10 years later I've moved on, lots of things have moved on, change is very r rapid and yet the panel is still going strong and it has become an exemplar for other people to get help from and, and copy the model that we've used.